Hello students, in the earlier lecture based on anthropological theories, we had learnt evolution as a concept. In this lecture, we will precisely learn about the classical evolutionary school of thought, which is also the first school of anthropological theory. Evolution Sir Herbert Spencer was the first one to define evolution as a term. Major break to the evolution theory of evolution was given by Charles Darwin. He was able to prove the process of evolution on the basis of paleontological evidence. Darwin's idea of natural selection, struggle for existence and survival of the fittest served as cornerstone for the development of the evolutionary theory. Evolutionism as a theory developed in the early 19th century. It can be classified as classical evolutionism and neo-evolutionism. Classical evolutionism has three schools of thought, namely the British, the German and the American school of thought, while the neo-evolutionism has two schools of thought, namely the British and the American school of thought. Basic Postulates of Classical Evolutionism Classical Evolutionism aimed at indicating mankind as unity and not diversity. Human culture evolves in unilinear sequence through different stages. Primitive societies were ancestors of more modern and civilized societies. Classical Evolutionism is progressive and proceed from simple to complex societies. Similarly, cultural traits of mankind is because of psychic unity of mankind. It refers to commonality of human mind that allows similar or common reactions like to environmental situations. Methodologies adopted for the study of classical evolutionism comparative and historical methods. Historical explanations help analyzing cultural varieties and is adapted to study and justify the fact that human cultures had undergone progressive change. Five philosophers are related to the British school of classical evolutionism, namely E.B. Taylor, R.R. Marriott, H. J. S. Maldane, J. F. McLennan, and Sir J. G. Fraser, the American and the German school of thought. In the American school of thought, one philosopher, that is Lewis Henry Morgan, is related to this American school of thought, while J. J. Bechofen and Adolf Bettison is related to the German or continental school of classic evolutionism. British Evolutionary School Edward Butler Taylor In his work Primitive Culture, he gave the first classical definition of culture. He was of the view that culture plays an important role for the product of social learning rather than biological product study of culture for mankind is the development of the society which passes through the stages of savagery to barbarism and finally rises to civilization two major contribution from this book was the doctrine of survivals and the theory of animism he also gave the idea of psychic unity of mankind According to him, all human beings having similar thinking patterns have same responses. Therefore, there are similarities between societies. In his book, Primitive Religion, he defined that religion was in simple form. It is called spiritual being. His great contribution lies in analysis of anima means soul. He said that every society in his world believes in spirituality. He believed in totemism. 
that is belief that soul resides in a totem a plant or animal and fetishism which means human beings control their deity through material objects moving forward to other british classical evolutionist philosophers r r marriott marriott was a student of e b taylor he was interested in the study of primitive religion he wrote a book the threshold of religion in 1909 according to him primitive religion could be understood in the terms of animatism that is belief in some impersonal power behind every material object besides living beings he also wrote the biography of taylor in which he described systematically about the concept of animism james fraser he wrote a book titled golden ball in 1890 he, in this book he explained that early men did not know anything about science they posed the wrong idea of natural causes he said all societies development passed through three stages that is magic religion and science further we come to henry james summer money also known as h j s money he wrote a book entitled ancient law in 1861 and early history of institution and another book village community in east and west in 1871 he also wrote early law and customs in 1875 in which he stated that patriarchal family is universal and original form of social life that is patria potesses John Ferguson Maclennan he worked in the field of primitive marriage he debated that earlier societies were patrilineal instead of being matrilineal they practiced polyandry the early societies were structured in a similar manner as today's society wherein the first form was the tribe the second was the house and the third was the family in his famous book named primitive marriage published in 1865 he coined the famous terms endogamy and exogamy used in social institutions he also explains the concept of bride capture from the tribal societies the complete understanding of British classical evolutionism let us do some multiple choice questions related to this topic the first question who was the first one to define the term evolution option a charles darwin option b jean lamarck option c herbert spencer option d eb taylor The correct answer to this question is option C Herbert Spencer. The second question which of the following are not the concepts given by EB Taylor? A doctrine of survival B theory of animism C psychic unity of mankind and D primitive culture. The correct answer to this question is option d primitive culture primitive culture is a book written by eb taylor in which he emphasizes on the role of culture in social development the third question who gave the idea of patria potestas that is patriarchy is the original form of social life a 
एच जे एस माने बी जेम्स फ्रेजर सी आर आर मैरिट डी ई बी टेलर द करेक्ट ऑप्शन टू दिस क्वेश्चन इज ए एच जे एस माने क्वेश्चन फोर विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज नॉट अवल ब्रिटिश इवोल्यूशनरी फिलोसोफर ए आर आर मैरिट बी जे एफ मैकलेन सी सर जे जी फ्रेजर डी लुइस हेनरी मॉगन द करेक्ट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इज डी लुइस हेनरी मॉगन द लास्ट एंड द फिफ्थ क्वेश्चन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज नॉट एन इवोल्यूशनिस्ट ए आर आर मैरियट बी लुइस हेनरी मॉगन सी जे जे बेचॉफिन एंड डी डब्ल्यू एच आर रिवर्स द करेक्ट आंसर फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन इज डब्ल्यू एच आर रिवर्स सो इन दिस लेक्चर वी लर्न अबाउट इवोल्यूशनिज्म वट आर द बेसिक पॉस्टुलेट्स ऑफ क्लासिक इवोल्यूशनिज्म वी फर्दर लर्न अबाउट द ब्रिटिश इवोल्यूशनरी स्कूल एंड इट्स डिफरेंट फिलोसफर्स वी बी टेलर आर आर मैरिट एच जे एस माने जे एफ मैकलेन सर जे जी फ्रेजर इन द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर वी विल डू द अमेरिकन एंड जर्मन स्कूल ऑफ एवोल्यूशन क्लासिक एवोल्यूशनरी थाट थैंक